what's good y'all welcome back to another video today we're playing drift 21 but not just any version of drift 21 my good friends at renaissance pr hooked us up today we are actually playing the full version renaissance pr has been working hard with 505 games to complete this so i haven't started anything we actually got the full version of the game today it's set to release july 10th we're gonna give this a shot so we got career mode quick race and multiplayer sandbox sandbox build the best drift cards with no cash limit and all content unlocked test them in practice mode and in multiplayer session start your drifting career build and tune drift cards take part in challenges to earn credit so we got a career mode we know what that is oh so we got an e30 oh e36 so we're gonna build us something here we don't we don't have no cash limit let me see uh so we got a mustang rx7 Oh, that RX-7 is looking nice. So we got Miata here. We might build this S-15, man. So we got a 182. I don't know. We might go with the S-15. So we don't have no engine. All right, we got to build this. Oh my God, this car is like empty. We don't have no seats. We don't have nothing. So we can buy a fully, a complete engine. Or we can just build a complete engine. I don't even know where to start. We finally finished. We ran into some hiccups, man. You know, we ran into a couple of problems, but it's all good. All right, so here is pretty much the finished product. I haven't put no custom rims on there yet. I just want to see if, if the car, you know, does well with how we have it pretty much. So, poof. All right, 200 horsepower, inline six, not bad. Let's move it to the dyno. All right, we looking all right, man. We looking okay. We're gonna go to single player with the car. What tracks do we have? Okay stadium version two parking ebisu school ebisu driftland training version one training version two parking oh that sounds crazy oh wow this camera view i'm not sure about this camera view let's change it let's see if the handbrake works that doesn't feel bad i actually might have to up the force feedback a lot actually we're low power right now oh my goodness <laughs> the physics don't feel horrible there we go i wonder if we can do any extra tuning on the side to like get ourselves to slide more Oh, 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 hey, this I'm actually so what other car angles do we have? Do we have a oh, we have a cockpit view, we have a cockpit view, huh? And he pulls the handbrake, <laughs> he doesn't shift, but he pulls the handbrake. That's dope. I still, I still feel like I have uh, my force feedback is too low. Let's see if we can go up. <laughs> Remember guys too, we're still on stock tires. Oh, so I see what it is with that force feedback. That power comes in like a little bit late. So I gotta mess with my settings here. Okay, so this is the behind the car box view. Wow, this can actually be something dope, man. I'm not sure if this track was on the partial version or the version that's uh, available for the public now. But I'm not gonna lie, as far as multiplayer goes and the way this game can be, I'm actually surprised the way it feels well. The brake works well, the response, the handbrake, look at that. And it kicks that out, clutch kicking. Oh, can we get through here? Oh, I can see down there on the bottom right too, my throttle, my brake and my clutch, like how much pressure I'm applying. So if I apply like a little bit of pressure, it shows you like, oh, I'm applying 20 or 30% pressure. We're drifting pretty well with stock tires here, though. I'll tell you that. 
we're gonna try for another heart uh, another hard flick and then let's get this whole spiral here oh i was trying to clutch kick so now comes the question as far as tuning if i can actually throw some camber on this thing oh my god that, that's so satisfying just being able to pull the handbrake and seeing that rear end just second gear yes yes there we go oh no <laughs> Ooh. so let's so we have adjustable suspension here hmm so i would have to get the adjustable suspension ah and the shock absorbers there we go so we gotta fully build this car open the garage and walk outside i hope I hope, man, when the full version is actually released to the public that we can actually leave the garage in our cars and explore. That's one thing that is uh, that would be crucial. Or we'd even load into a multiplayer match and walk outside and boom, there's other people out here already chilling outside the garage, you know? That would be crazy. That would be something crazy, but I'm liking our little S15 here. I'm not gonna lie, I'm liking it. So we got a stadium. Wow. So this is a little, just a little stadium track. This, I can see this right now being a little tandem track. Ooh, banging that gear. We're in third. I'm pretty, the way it feels right now and to the fact that I've added no like type of difference in suspension or anything like that. I know now that once I start messing with the suspension and the shock absorbers and stuff, this thing is gonna feel really nice. And it's all adjustable too. So I would imagine the parts that you can buy, if they say adjustable, you can adjust them somewhere. I wonder if they have like a, oh, this is a camera cockpit with no driver. Oh, and it has the neck effects. So if you do the cockpit with no driver, he actually, you actually like turn in the car and look the way you're drifting. I appreciate you guys for watching the video, man. Check out Drift 21 if you haven't already. The full version isn't out yet. Set to release July 10th. Once again, I want to thank good friends over at Renaissance PR for uh, letting us try out the full game today. I'll catch you guys in the next one. This is.